my channel. I know it's been a while since I posted a vlog up, but I thought I would vlog this week. Um, it's been pretty crazy lately. Excuse the wind and the noise. I have the windows down. But anywho, it's been a little crazy lately. I got a new job um, and it's going really well. And I've been working some different crazy hours that I'm not used to. As most of you guys know, I'm a morning person, so I'm used to waking up at like 3.30, 4 in the morning, and now I'm waking up at like 9, because um, I usually start work around 10 or 9, whatever. Um, so yeah, that's been a little weird. Um, but anyways, back to the vlog. I thought I would vlog for you guys this week, and nothing exciting going on. Just wanted to go ahead and post something up for you guys since it's been a while. So heading to Walmart right now, got to get some groceries, and I will see you guys in a little bit. I was gonna go down the clearance aisle, but it smells like mustard, oddly. Why does it smell like mustard? I don't know, but that was disgusting. Sorry, I was trying to talk here and for some reason it wasn't picking up my voice. But these are the toothpaste my sister told me about and I usually get these ones. I get the whitening ones and I love it. Um, it's the peppermint flavor but they're all organic, fluoride free and everything. So you guys should try them. Alright you guys, we just got done, we, me, just got done grocery shopping. Whew. It's a hot one out here today. Oh my goodness. <sighs> one little thing of advice. Thing of advice, yes. Um, don't go grocery shopping when you're hungry. Now it's time to go to lunch. I don't know what I want to eat. Wendy's or Cafe Yum. Haven't had Cafe Yum for a long time. So I think that's what I'm about to get. I don't know if they have cafe yums everywhere, but if you guys haven't tried it, you need to try it. That yum sauce is everything. Everything, oh my gosh. Literally, you can put it on everything, a salad, a wrap, anything. So here we go, and it's right across the street. How convenient. So what I usually get from here is the Yum Baby in a wrap it um, tortilla. Um, you can get either wheat or white tortilla. I get white tortilla because I'm allergic to the wheat. Um, but it has avocado, yum sauce, tomatoes. Get it without cilantro because it's disgusting. And like brown rice or regular, I think it's jasmine rice, but it's so good. Okay, you guys, I seriously just ate <clears throat> that huge burrito in like two minutes. <sighs> so now I'm dying, but it was so good eating makes me so happy so I'm gonna go to Ulta <laughs> I gotta go to Ulta to get to one thing hopefully just one thing so that's where we're going next um, I'm gonna show you guys the cafe yum sign so you can see what it kind of looks like I don't know if they have it elsewhere but you guys should try it because their sauce is amazing I'll eat their sauce like by itself it's so good so let me show you the sign real quick and then we're gonna head on to Ulta this is what the sign looks like. The first time I ever tried it was in Springfield, Oregon, where I'm originally from. Now it's in Vancouver, Washington. I think they also have a few in Portland as well, but you guys should try it if it's in your area. It's super good. Yep, so that didn't work. I ended up getting three things. When I was supposed to get one, but what else is new? That always happens. <laughs> I don't feel no pressure. On the good side, I'm going to check the mail because I think my Morphe brushes subscription and my 35F palette came in. So let's see. Gotta walk up another hill. So let's see if it came in. I'm excited. Let's check her out. Oh, oh 
What is that? What is that? I think I know what it is. Oh wait, this is my sister's shirt. Dang it, Shelby. Did we seriously just get something from Ulta? Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. <gasps> so everything but what I wanted just came in the mail. I just walked all the way over here for nothing. So let's see what we got in here from Ulta. So this is what we got. I guess we got a little ex or example, a little sample of all of the Vice lipsticks. The new Vice Urban Decay Vice lipsticks. So yeah, a lot of pretty colors. I think I'm going to like these ones the best. Oh yes. But they're all beautiful. So I just got done filming this look here. Look how glowy. I'm like Rudolph the highlighter nosed reindeer. It's like a glowy summer bronzy look for you guys so yeah i don't know if i'm gonna have this vlog up probably not this vlog up but probably this look before my vlog you guys just check that out oh my gosh it's like it should be illegal to have this much highlight on you're gonna blind people i was gonna film my unboxing video too but everything has shipped it just hasn't arrived yet so it'll probably be in by next monday so i'll be doing that for you guys but yeah, I should have this video up in the next few days. I'm excited to share it with you. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted to try the Revolution products and uh, Revolution bronzer, the Illuminator bronzer. Man, you guys can't really tell right now, but it is everything. It's amazing and it's super pigment pigmented. It's only $6, but I think it's going to be my new go-to for the summertime especially. But you guys should try it. Also, I should probably tell you guys too, I'm wearing the Ritzy um, Kiss Lashes and honestly these ones are so easy to put on. I mean I love the Ardell Lashes but they're so hard for me to put on. I don't know if it's the band or what it is, but these ones I just plopped them right on super quick. So you guys should try them. But yeah, I'm about to get wipe this face off, clean up my mess I made because I just cleaned the room and now you notice I keep going like this, like I'm talking to you guys like this. I just want to because I want you guys to just endure endure this highlight right now. I use champagne pop, by the way. I'm gonna clean clean up my mess, go ahead and upload this to my computer so I can start editing it and just cuddle up until my husband gets from home from work and watch some Nashville on Hulu. So that's what's on for the rest of the night. I'll go ahead and vlog tomorrow on my way to work. But as far as tonight goes, I think I'm outros. I'm done for the day. I'm tired. So yeah, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. So my vanity is pretty it's pretty disgusting right now. Um, but I thought I'd share with you guys what I have here for now since it's a little cleaner than it was before. <laughs> so I have like my bracelets over here, my lotion, some earrings, some glitter. You know, deodorant, all lotions, hair products. Got my air spun. And in this first drawer here, I have mostly facial products that I've gotten in my Ipsy bags. Just like face masks, um, moisturizers, etc. This little thing has my contour palette by Wet n Wild. And I have some other things that I got in my Ipsy bag, I also got a little illuminating highlight from Wet n Wild. In this drawer I have my cushion foundation, some random bare minerals, Philosophy and Bella P. Air blush, and some Q-tips. This one here has my face mask that I've been trying out from Ipsy that I got in my Ipsy bag. Um, Mainly in these drawers, I have like my random Ipsy stuff, like the samples that I get. I have some eyeshadows from ColourPop, NYX Prismatic eyeshadow, some blush, some bronzer from Pixie, my MAC bronzer, give me sun bronzer. This one, I have like my highlighter from Physicians Formula, and a bunch of random eyeshadows from like Victoria's Secrets, like the first eyeshadows I ever used in my entire life. <laughs> Then over here, some NYX products, a lot of NYX products, um, some of my soft matte lip creams, my Fit Me Maybelline, 
little contour I use that to contour my face um, some liquid suede my Lumi foundation which is my favorite as you can see it's my favorite because I just throw it around <laughs> this is my favorite foundation that I've ever tried um, and then we have my Kylie lip glosses back there my Mil my Milani conceal and perfect foundation and some Sephora color correctors in this little drawer I had my some highlights my Anastasia um, they're supposed to go back in there but I just filmed um, my Anastasia so Hollywood and my Becca champagne pop I have some brow products here my wonder brow some eyeliners from NYC Kat Von D eyeliner and just a bunch of random eyeliners and dip brows and <clears throat> and I do have some NYX glitter brilliance here I have the copper one the teal one and I also just re just received just bought the gunmetal one which I want to try for sure soon down here I just filmed like I said so I have my Z palette and I have my champagne pop this revolution ba baked bronzer my NYX banana powder moving along over here I have some lip liners some eyeliners and my color pop matte lipsticks um, some NYX liquid liners like the glittery ones and random lipsticks that obviously I don't use that's why they're all dusty <laughs> Over here I have my daily moisturizers that I use every day, some more concealers, some of those little shavers, and yeah, just a bunch of concealers over here and a few foundations. Over here I have a light that I got from Ikea that I love, one of those little trimmers and, and some skizzers so I can trim my brows. Over here I have some lotion in there, I have my q-tips in there all my brushes hanging out over here big brushes small brushes which I need to clean then I have some coconut oil coffee cups tea cups this I use to clean up my eyebrows I squirt it into this little thing there and I clean up my eyebrows with the q-tips I have in there then I have some sponges straightener slay all days nice little mirror that I use and yeah that's mainly it I do have some drawers down here that have random hair products and stuff um, and I have my hats, my leather hats, and my Nike hats, and etc. there. So that's basically what I have for now. Um, obviously I'll be getting a beauty room when I move, but for now it's kind of all stashed up here. So, yeah, excuse the mess, but this is just kind of my starter. I know some of you guys will laugh when I say starter because, yeah, that's a lot of makeup. So, yeah, that is all. Alright, you guys. It is now Tuesday morning and I'm heading to go work out at our little clubhouse by our house just a little gym in the basement here <clears throat> hoping no one's here because I hate working out when somebody else is here because it's so small but as long as I get a workout in it's all good I miss when I used to come here with my twin. We used to work out early in the morning, but now my hours have changed, so. Oh, look at those pretty blue flowers. All right, you guys, so I just finished my workout, but I thought I'd show you in here. This is the little basement where we work out at. Has a couple machines here. Ellipticals, little bike and everything. Some weights. And out there's the pool. I can show you guys that real quick. And then there's this little thing here too. And there's the stairs that we come down. Here's a little place where the kids can play if, you know, somebody wants to come work out and they have kids and they have no one to watch them. And then through this door is gonna be a couple showers in the pool here. Where's the, there we go. And then there is a sauna as well. But here's the pool. Swim in here sometimes, but it's usually pretty busy, especially during the summertime. And then out there is the hot tub. That's pretty cool. Back here, I don't know what else is back there, but yeah. Oh, can I get up? There we go. But yeah, gonna head home now. Get my shower in, and let's always use hand sanitizer. And yeah. Hey 
you guys i just got to work but i want to let you guys know that i'm ending this vlog here because i'm just going to be doing this all week going to work da 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 the same exact thing so i don't think you guys want to see all that so i thought i'd end this vlog here and probably next weekend i'm gonna go ahead and vlog like the weekend or something for you guys so it's a little funner um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate it um but we'll see you guys soon and you guys have a good rest of your week